A rollover crash claimed one young life last night and seriously injured two other teenagers. All school activities in Carlisle are postponed tonight as the community comes together. Good evening, I'm Andy Fails. I'm Erin Kiernan. The call came in a little after nine last night. A single car crash with three teenagers inside. Police arrived to find a Toyota Camry on each side in the ditch. The crash happened just west of Hartford near the intersection of 200th Avenue and Delaware Street. Police say the driver lost control, went into the ditch, and then launched over a driveway. WHO 13 Zach Fisher joins us now live in Carlisle. A devastating crash for this Carlisle community, Zach. Absolutely, Andy. There was uh, baseball and softball games. First pitch was supposed to be at 6 p.m. tonight, but those are postponed as you see the baseball boys out here practicing right behind me. Now we know this. Uh, you can see this post on the Carlisle Activities X page saying, quote, due to the tragic accident last evening involving Carlisle students, tonight's baseball, softball games versus Boone are postponed continued. Our priority is to support our students, families, and entire school community at this time. Let's take you to the scene here with the drone view. The drone's going northbound, same direction as the car just last night. Car going into the west ditch there on the left side of the road. You can see tire marks and divots in the dirt from the car rolling multiple times. You're also able to see uh, the circles in the field in this different shot where the life lights came in for transportation. And here's a a uh, quick look here at some of the debris of what it looked like along the gravel road there on 200th Avenue. Uh, There's debris scattered along the ditch, including a door and a car manual. Now, no one uh, talking with us on camera today, but I did talk to the Carlisle superintendent over the phone, uh, Eric Anderson. The district understandably withholding further comments until the uh, names are released and uh, State Patrol releases more information. Uh, some other conversations I had today, the community is well aware. I talked with the neighbor closest to the property where the accident had occurred, saying that uh, he just graduated and he actually knew uh, all three of those involved. And shooting video today, the grandparents of one of the victims uh, came over and, and asked me, uh, where it was, what had happened. They told me their granddaughter was being life lighted to Iowa City, still working to confirm that uh, with authorities. And they also were uh, calling a boy in the car involved in the accident to transport to the hospital. They were calling his actions heroic, uh, punching through the sunroof, uh, receiving 60 some stitches uh, on his arm. Like I said, we're still working to confirm that information, but the game's canceled tonight as uh, our hearts are with the Carlisle community this evening, Andy. All right, Zach Fisher with that report from Warren County. Thank you, Zach. Mm -hmm.